video we will learn how to use different tools that are present in the shapes group the first tool that we will discuss is line tool this is the line tool okay um, and to using this line tool we can draw straight lines So to select this tool, we will bring the mouse pointer over this tool and we will press left mouse button over it once. And to draw the line, we will bring the mouse pointer in the drawing area. Now you can see the mouse pointer shape is plus sign. And to draw the line, we will press left mouse button once and then we will drag the mouse to draw the line. And after that, we will release the mouse button. Now if I want to draw another straight line, okay, then again we will place the mouse pointer, okay. After creating a first line, you will click on the blank area, okay, and then you will draw another line, okay. So in this way, you can draw another line, then we will, you cl you will click in the blank area, and you can draw another line, okay. So in this way, we can draw the straight lines. Then we will click on the blank area and we will draw another straight line. So to draw a straight line, we have to press left mouse button once and then drag the mouse. Okay. So in this way, we can draw the straight lines. Okay. After making first line, okay, you have to click anywhere in the blank area. Okay. Then in this way, we can draw. Okay. So in this way we can draw the lines to make okay the shapes okay the different drawings okay it depends upon so I'm using sh this sing okay this line tool to draw the shape okay remember this so in this way we can draw the shapes or the we can see the drawings okay using line two so I have used here line tool to draw this figure so you can see okay after making after creating a small okay single line or after drawing a small line we have to click anywhere in the blank area okay with the help of left mouse button and then okay, we can draw the next line so in this way we can make use of line tool to draw different drawings okay and if you want to fill the color we can select this tool fill with color tool from the tools group by pressing left by bringing the mouse pointer over it and then pressing left mouse button over it once after that we will select okay I can select any color from here and bring I will bring the mouse point inside it and we can fill the color okay I will select another color from here okay and we can click over here and another color from here okay so in this way we can fill the colors okay and so this is how you can draw small drawings okay using line tool and you can also fill uh, color okay using this tool that is filled with color tool after selecting it by bringing the mouse pointer over it and then pressing left mouse button you can select it and then in the colors group from the colors group you can select different colors and after selecting the color okay you have to bring the mouse pointer inside the that boundary where you want to fill the color next is curve tool this is the curve tool the second one now to use the curve tool okay uh, we can uh, we have to bring the mouse pointer over this then press left mouse button over it okay so now this tool is selected now I want to draw the black color curve okay so I have selected the color black from here and you can see the color one is here in the, the color is changed to black okay so 
after selecting this tool okay we will bring the mouse pointer in this area and here we will draw the curve line we will pre i will press your left mouse button once and then i will drag the mouse okay and after that i will release the mouse now we can give curve shape to this line two times okay if we click on this side once then curve will be formed on this side okay if i click on this side okay then you can see the curve is on this side okay this is the curve now let us now after that what you will do you will click on this again okay to draw another curve line if we don't click over this again what will happen same another curve will be given to the same line so i don't want that okay because we can give curve to a same line two times remember this we can modify the curve two times now i want to give okay uh, this line okay curve to this side to so this is the curve after that i will again click on this tool okay to draw another curve okay i will click over it and then i will click over here and again this way we can get the curve and after that we will i am going to draw a line starting from this okay a curve can be modified two times remember this you can see here whenever i'm clicking second times okay the curve is modified let me show you again okay if i draw a line from here to here so one time i can click over here curve is on this side but if i click one more time on this side okay so i have given a little bit curve similarly i can use one more over here okay i will use i will draw a straight line over here and one i will give on this side okay another on here so this is the curve okay and next again i will draw a line over here and another i will click for the first time here this is the curve and second time okay a little bit here okay like this we can modify the curve line okay this <coughs> curve line two times remember this we can press two times to give curve to the line so next time again i will draw a line over here okay starting from this to this line is there first i will click on this side okay to give a curve and a little bit on this side and again i will draw a line from starting from here to here okay first i will click here okay and then a little bit here okay so i think it's a little bit incorrect let us make change to it um, let us draw a small line over here first of all and we will click once over here and then here okay and again okay to draw the curve we will select this one a little bit curve on this side and if we click one more time we can modify it so and we will give one more curve line over here okay this one one on one this side and i will click on this side again and we can modify this line two times okay or we can say we can give curve to the line two times okay next time we have to click somewhere so okay so that we can give a curve either we can click on same direction okay suppose let let me show you i have drawn this line to draw a curve first time i will click on this again if i click over this so again on same side the curve will be applied okay if i click on this side the curve will be on this side next time so now to fill the color what we will do we will can select the color on this tool fill with color tool from the tools group and we will bring the mouse pointer in the colors group and i will select this green color after selecting the color i will bring the mouse pointer in the inside this part and this is the Okay, and then to fill the color in this part of the tree okay we will select the brown color and we can fill the color in this manner so in this way we can use make use of a curve tool to draw the 
okay drawing next is uh, oval tool so we can also you make of use of oval tool to draw the circles okay so to select this we will bring the mouse pointer over it and we will press left mouse button over it now color selected is brown but i want to draw the circle of color black so i will select the color black and then to draw the circle i will make a window over here for this home so this is the window of this okay and uh, i want here okay then i want here the color okay then in the side this is yellow color so i can select this fill with color tool and i will select the color yellow and i will bring this okay cursor inside the circle and here we can fill the color yellow so in this way we can make us okay i have created a circular window okay so in this way we can use over tool in our drawings okay wherever it is required even we can make a sun okay using this oval tool or moon in our drawing and next tool is rectangle tool this is the rectangle tool okay this one and to select this tool we have to bring the mouse pointer over the this tool and then we have to press left mouse button over it once and okay so we can draw okay here a path for the okay i will if okay so let us select first of all color here black color and after selecting the color we will bring the mouse pointer okay in this area okay and we will drag this okay to draw the rectangle here we can okay in this we can fill a color a brown color rather than brown color let us fill here a little bit of gray color okay like this so it is just like a path or you can say it is a road okay outside the this okay so in this way we can draw the drawing okay now we can make the pictures and paint and or we can create the pictures we can say next is uh, polygon tool this is the polygon tool okay polygons means we can draw different shapes okay uh, shapes having three sides or more than three sides let me draw here the first shape having three sides that is called triangle using this tool polygon to select this tool we have to bring the mouse pointer over it and then we have to press left mouse button over it once and to draw the polygon okay uh, we can click over okay let me select here first color okay i will select here color black first okay and then we will draw the polygon okay i will draw here two polygons both polygons will be rectangle not rectangle triangle sorry okay so to draw the polygon we will press left mouse button once and then we will drag the mouse okay now first line or the first side of the polygon is drawn after making it now to draw the another side of the polygon we will click here so line will be drawn from here to here okay now if i click over here you can see the line is there starting from this point to this now to close it i will click over here okay now similarly i can draw another polygon okay after that i we can place this okay over here and this is the first line okay now i want to draw a line from this point to this okay so i will click over here so automatically a line will be drawn and to close this i will click over here so in this way we can okay uh, draw the polygons so i have created a small star over here okay it looks like it's not more like a star okay but yeah now it's fine okay using this okay border dotted border we can uh, increase and decrease the size as well as we can also move okay you can see the mouse pointer is changing to four headed arrow 
if we press left mouse button and if we move the mouse okay after holding the left mouse button so we can move it okay even we can increase and decrease the size using these okay these are known as handles okay resize handles you will study this in higher class for the time being okay just remember using these okay handles we can resize okay the mouse pointer changes to double headed arrow okay so we can resize it as per our requirement so in this way we can make the star and if we want to fill the color we will select fill with color tool from the tools group by pressing left mouse button over it after bringing the mouse pointer over it and then we can fill the color I will select yellow color from the colors group and after that we will bring the mouse pointer inside the boundary and wherever is the white color inside the boundary we will click inside it to fill the color okay so in this way we can make use of polygon tool to draw the okay different polygons okay and with the help of polygons we can draw different shapes okay or we can say different drawings so this covers up okay few tools of shapes group